My interests are around the theories and practices of everyday life, so I needed that connection with the real world. Eventually, I ended up working at Plymouth College of Art, um, working in the gallery, and then I was asked to teach on a module on everyday life, which of course was my practice. So whilst working in this amazing gallery, I got to see these amazing students, and I've been teaching there ever since, and I, and I love it. Because I get to spend every day with students, lecturers and technicians who are artists, designers, makers and thinkers. Everyone in that building at Plymouth College of Art is creative. I get to see my students develop from people unsure about what is expected of them. Many of them ready to run away like I did when I was first at college to watching them build their skills and knowledge and confidently go into the world to tell their own unique stories as illustrators, graphic designers, fashion designers, interior designers, painters, animators, anything that they set their minds to. Plymouth College of Art is a unique space because it's a university for the creative mind. Everyone in this building is telling stories. Everyone in this building is in the same boat as you, wanting to use their creative spark to make something new, to move people, to improve something. So I mentioned that I'm the subject leader and senior lecturer for Contextual Studies. So what is Contextual Studies? Well, at Plymouth College of Art, Contextual Studies is the element that ties together our understanding of our practices and where they sit in the world. We approach ideas through creative practice and never forget that as makers, we are thinkers. And as thinkers, we are the same tradition as some of the greatest creative minds in history. Without my own experience of art college, I wouldn't have had the confidence to do what I do each day. And if you're creative, and if you're an inquisitive person interested in exploring ideas and making something new, maybe telling the world your story through your creative practice, then you should certainly consider Plymouth College of Art as a place that you should come and visit, come and see, because once you see this place, you become enchanted by it. And hopefully you'll have the same sort of stories to tell that I do somewhere down the road. Okay. Hope this has been useful if you are considering coming um, and hopefully I'll get to meet you soon. Thank you.